Dragon form's oh, ready. And get the hell away from there. Ramsey's being chased back by the Ench. Probably Ready time for Ramsey to leave this top part of the map now. I'm gonna try and turn back on this Ench, but Pasha arrives and he's gonna say goodbye to this Dusa. Big old whack. And clears out Ramsey's. Now Emoji coming in, gonna take down two for one. Double kill for Pasha, this is gonna open up that. Ready with a blink, he breaks a smoke already. And he sees three of these Radiant Heroes all wondering what the hell is going on. How did, does have his own. <laughs> How did they see us? When he picked up the Omni Knight, just stun the Omni, get immersion, catch and kill the Omni. Pasha trying to fight back here, does land a nice two man Starbreaker. Ogo with this DK still standing tall. Understood. Keep him back for long enough. Co involved in some of these ganks and fights. Does pick up his Aghanim Shard now, it looks like. So GPK, Spirit Vessel, and the Hood. So we are getting some of these anti-healing elements coming in. Medusa with the Scardi, of course, you mentioned. We'll be moving towards that. Do you think, is Ramsey going to finish off Manta now, or is it going to be Dragonlance Yasha? Oh, wow. God, they're losing that Ogre down bottom. And GPK gets away from the Remnant. I even think about turning on the Remnant here. Side down, the damage from the sky. Okay. Oh, huge burst. The DM gets to jump on the Pasha. This is a pretty big streak to take, but the Guardian Angel he allows him to be so much tankier while GPK being pummeled by the Starbreaker. And the impetus shots. And Chantress, the real carry now. DM. Oh, it's pure damage coming in from End. We're killing him off as the Stone Gaze does clip onto the Dawnbreaker's form, but that's a, a price they're willing to pay. They're even going to try and set up. The press kit is actually getting ready to defend the spot. I don't know. Are they strong enough for this? Oh, they, they feel like they are. Chance of TPA. Aegis claimed in the go. The press kit catches GPK. And Chantress. Some big damage, but now the Shroud and the turnaround. Trying with the Reaper side, but holding out as GPK will be able to kill off the press kit and immersion, even without using that side. Now we turn on the Pasha. Kill him with it instead. A double kill for the Necro and a triple kill for him. Hell yeah, it steals 20% <laughs> of stacks. Like, that's honestly that's 70 huge, that's attack huge. speed from a Medusa. Yeah, she can be crippled. I mean, how, how long does that last? The whole, whole fight? Uh, I, I don't know. So you just mute her an entire team fight, basically. They're going to jump. DM with his Mystic Flare help kills off Immersion. And Coma, he turned into the DK, but didn't get the catch on the damage. The press kid still trying to fight as Hakuda being battered out by Pasha. There's GPK, though, with the Reaper's Scythe. Killing off the Ench, the true carry of Barry Parnies. Life has been played. Coma just TPing out again. Dissimilate, not going to allow the press kid to get out of this one. Surrounded by outside. Tanks through the initiation. And hit the Stone Gaze onto the Dawn. Reaper Scythe onto that Morphling. Not enough to kill him, but they've separated the fight far enough for outsiders to pick off target after target now. Partial slow by the Scardy Slow. And the concussive shot with that. A nice minus heal from the Spirit Vassal. It should be enough to fin finish him off with. Medusa still has the Aegis. has fallen. Incredibly challenging situation for the Radiant now to contend with all the items, all of the levels. The Ag is online. Oh yeah. Is it Look, gonna stop him though? He's hitting so slow. Oh, oh, but DM, he hits fast. Blink stun, Mystic Flare, Immersion, and this poor Enchantress blown up. No buybacks on either of them. Three heroes in the grave. And Outsiders looks like they're locking up game one with this Black Dragon of DM. Whacking into buildings. GPK just sitting in front of Bouncer and forcing the GG to come out of them. So yeah, game one will go to Outsiders. I really, really like the effect of that axe. I know